Well, hey guys, Keithy Six here, metal detecting in Alaska. We had a couple rainy days, so today's a really nice day, so I'm back out at this new bottle pit that I found, uh, cannon bottle dump. So let's see if we can find anything new here. Oh, the rain washed these off good. Check that out. Maybe we'll find more to this. All right, cool. Let's start looking around. Well, I found a lot of cans here last time. So I'm gonna get them all cleared out of the way. I remembered my pistol today, so. In case there's any maminals. I just had a hit of glass. Ah, oh, that was probably it right there. Look at that. The bottom to an old Clorox bottle. Yep, that's what it was. I just found this cool little looking little jar. Shame it's broke. Okay, let's keep looking. Well, I've been digging around and I heard a scratch of glass. Hey, it's whole. Looks just like the other one, but it's whole. Sweet. What does it say on the bottom? Alright, I'll have to get my glasses and take a look at it. Oh, it's got embossing on the side too. Sweet. Alright, let me look at this. Okay, so obviously it says it's French. It's French's. And on the bottom it says... Uh, Design patent February 23rd, 1915. All right, well, first really good bottle of the day. Man, I've been wearing these safety glasses ever since I got a giant chunk of dirt in my eye, you know, popping up stuff and it poof, right in my eye. So it's a good idea to wear safety glasses. It'll save you a lot of pain and suffering. Hey, check this out. I just found a, a, a glass cork. Nice. All right. I don't see any writing on it. Sweet. All right, another cool find. Now, so far, I've been finding stuff like caps, old tobacco tins. And uh, the occasional bottle. Wow, look at this snazzy lid. I think I found some old doorknob, but it kind of fell apart. Look at it. Nice shiny black little doorknob. It's a shame it broke. Well, I found two of these so far. And I'm starting to wonder if that's some type of old explosive or something. It's just in the shape of a stick of dynamite. Okay, so I probed glass and then I'm like, oh, what the heck, there's a can. Look at this. There's a bottle inside the can. Wow, look at all the lines on this thing. Oh, it's a shame there's no embossing on it. All right, but sweet bottle. Look at that. It's half full of juice too. And it was inside a can, so that's really cool. All right. 
All right, well, we'll take it home and clean it up. Cool find. Let's keep looking. Let's check this out. I found the two legs, and then I found a top with the cover. That's pretty sweet. Well, I'm hoping I got another bottle here. Oh, look at that. I found a cobalt today. Sweet. All right, I had to put my glasses on, but it says Ingram's Shaving Cream. Sweet. Another cobalt for my collection. I don't have this one. So awesome. Guys, check this out. I just found a little mini ax head. Is that cool or what? Oh man, that is sweet. You can see where the handle went through it. Get some of that dirt out of there. There we go. Now you can see through it. It's got a weird looking edge to it, that's for sure. Cool find. All right, let's keep going. <clears throat> well, I've been digging, and uh, I think I found another one of those metal plates right here. Look underneath it, there's a bottle. Look at that, guys. And it's got freaking writing on it. Wow. Ooh. Look at that crap. Yuck. Sweet old bottle. I think it says Lysol. Yeah. Oops. Wow, I think it's an old Lysol bottle. All right, so it says on the bottom, Lysol Incorporated, uh, Bloomfield, New Jersey, bottle made in USA. That is sweet. All right, let's keep looking. Wow, and here's this piece that was uh, over top of that bottle. Obviously another part of this stove up here. Cool. Wow, I just found another piece to that. Wow, that would have been a heck of a bottle. Shame it's broke. Well, I think I found yet another piece to that stove. There's a third leg. Wow, and there's the fourth leg. So I think I've dug up almost the whole thing. Check this out. Wish I could have found that hole. So I've been digging up a lot of broken pieces since that last bottle. And I found this. I'm hoping it's still whole. Oh, wow, look how little. And it's got a lid on it. Little medicine bottle. All right, well, I'll take it. I like the little ones. All right, so sweet. Well, that's pretty cool. Just found this little tin. Well, just found an, 
Just found another one of those little tins, and this one says aspirin. Pretty cool. All right, I was going to try to dig one more bottle, and then I'm going to take off and go home. Look at this. Oh, another small medicine bottle. Owens. Sweet. Well, I was just taking a break and cooling off. Started poking around, and look at this. Some pieces, some arms and stuff. I think it used to be like a somebody dancing. Isn't that crazy? It does have a mark over here. Or maybe not. But anyways, while I was pulling that out, check this out. I pulled out this tiny bottle. Tiny, tiny. And it even has a lid on it. Look at that. Oh, and it turns. Sweet. All right, well, that's probably going to do it for me. I might just poke around here for a few minutes, and then I'm going to head home and get ready for the roundup. I thought I saw some riding on there. All right, guys, we'll see you at the roundup. Well, hey, guys, welcome to the roundup. I finally made it home and tried to get these bottles cleaned up. Check these out. This one came out really nice. No writing on it, just some numbers. But this Lysol cork top. All embossed across the top. And all embossed on the bottom. Made in America, in USA. I like that. That's sweet. And then I found that French's mustard. It's the French. It's it's French's. It says. And then it has the writing on the bottom. And then I found this Ingram's shaving cream. I love finding those blue cobalts. Man, that's nice. And then I found these three smaller bottles. I cannot get inside this one to clean it. Look, it even has a lid. I'm assuming that was probably like perfume or something. Didn't have a smell. But boy, this Lysol bottle had a smell. It smelled like antiseptic. Uh, these were little medicine bottles. This one even had the lid on it still. And I found a glass cork top. It cleaned up real nice. And found a couple little lids. And then I found these little tins. This one's a laxative. And this one's aspirin. And then I found this little axe head. And I was wondering why it was shaped like that. Well, if you look, you can see it broke. And that popped out to the side. So it's still... I like finding those. Those are pretty cool. Alright guys, so that's about it. Not a bad hunt for just like two hours. Alright, I'm excited to see what I'll find next time when I go there. Alright guys, till next time, good luck and happy hunting. Mm -hmm.